Today, what I'm doing is I'm gonna be making a plant-based uh, Mexican pizza, kind of like what Taco Bell sells, but I'm making it myself. homemade Mexican pizza is done. I um, All I did was I pan fried a couple of um, a couple of flour tortillas, pan fried them on each side so they were crispy, not burnt. Um, and then I, I smeared on some refried beans, some, some cooked or seasoned black beans that I made using Burrinti taco season, which is salt free by the way. Um, and then I sandwich it in between the two tortillas. Then I put um, some enchilada sauce on top. Just smeared it on the top. Put some diet cheese, uh, plant-based diet cheese on it. Oh, I forgot to mention that this is a plant-based version. You can make the same thing with the ground beef like they do at Taco Bell if you want, but I use the black beans instead and all plant-based stuff. So plant-based cheese on top of the um, on top of the enchilada sauce. And then I had some diced tomatoes that I put um, on, on the top. Then I threw it in the oven and let that cook until uh, the cheese was melted, basically. Um, and that's it. In the oven at 400 degrees for about, I don't know, 12 to 15 minutes. Um, I did turn the broiler on too, just to melt the cheese, because this diet cheese doesn't melt as fast as regular cheese, so I turned the broiler on for like two minutes just to melt it all the way. So I'm gonna go ahead and slice this up and dig in. I'm also gonna have some avocados on the side with it too, so that's it. Um, homemade Mexican pizza. This is a plant-based version, but like I said, you can make your own, um, you can make some seasoned meat and use that instead of the black bean. Bruce Strong, and eat well. <laughs>